Plan Fam, welcome back to another video. I'm MUA Mommy for those who are new here. And if you are new here, go ahead and quickly hit that subscribe button and little bell icon so you can be notified whenever I upload a video. So today's video has been highly requested for me to do. It is my everyday skincare routine along with some helpful tips, tricks, my skincare must-haves. The brand that I have been using is Mario Badescu. I started using Mario Badescu exactly a month ago as of the first of this month. I will put up some before and after photos. So in the first photo was the day one that I started. The second photo is two weeks into it and then the third photo will be a month into using it and as you can tell my skin has been looking really nice really clear I'm super happy with it and I'm absolutely obsessed a quick disclaimer this video is not sponsored I just genuinely love this brand so first things first I'm gonna take off my ring I don't personally like getting my jewelry ripped for me the key to good skincare is also drinking a lot of water I know that sounds really cliche but it's true water is good for your body it does good things for your skin I drink about 10 of these bottles a day I'm not exaggerating about that by the way I drink a lot of water especially right now here in Oregon summertime it is very hot with all the fires out it's very smoky and it's good for you anyways so stay hydrated I have all of my skincare stuff out I'm not gonna use all of it just because I don't need to do a bunch of different face masks tonight and stuff but I will tell you guys the order that I do my makeup in I will take my makeup off if I'm wearing makeup for that day I do my cleanser and then I do my toner and then an eye cream and then a moisturizer. Now on days or weeks that I'm having a really bad breakout, if I'm super stressed or something, I will use a face mask and I do have quite a different variety of face mask. It really just depends. So to remove my makeup, since I'm not wearing any today, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys, I use the Ulta Beauty Oil Free Eye Makeup Remover. This is what I use to take off my eyebrows and my eye makeup. And then to take off the rest of my makeup, I just use the Ulta Beauty Makeup Removing Wipes. They're super soft, super cheap. They smell really good and they do the job well and then after that I go ahead and I wet my face down so I'm gonna go ahead and do that I have a bowl of water in my area right now so I can act you guys can actually see me doing this so I wet my face and I use lukewarm water not too hot not too cold however that's for the evenings though but in the mornings I do wash my face with cold water because it helps reduce puffiness and redness so I'm just gonna get my face wet here now that my face is nice and wet, I go in with the Mario Badescu Seaweed Cleansing Face Wash. Now this bottle along with my toner bottle, they're brand new bottles because I ran out of my other ones so I got more because the ones I originally had were the travel size ones because I wanted to try them before I went and bought the whole thing so obviously I love it. So this is the Mario Badescu Seaweed Cleansing Soap. This one here is good for all skin types, all the Mario Badescu stuff is cruelty free as well and you can order all of this stuff online and I'll show you some online goodies I got from them just for taking a quiz I think and I only had to pay shipping and I'll show you that box in a minute so I take this and then I take this face brush right here this is an equal tools my mom got them at Walmart I just find that it's easier to get in the crevices of your face when you're using like a face brush versus your hands I seriously love the way this stuff smells you don't need a lot by the way a little bit does go a long ways and I still probably put too much on there but I'm good at doing that and then I just scrub get the brush wet a little bit again and then I go back in there froth it up a bit if that's even a word careful to avoid your eyes you don't want to get soap in your eyes it's not pleasant I'm gonna go ahead and dry that off I'm trying not to make a mess I'm literally have a bowl of water in my beauty area because filming in the bathroom wouldn't have been ideal I'm gonna go ahead and rinse all of that off and then pat dry with a towel you don't want to rub dry you want to pat dry and I completely forgot why you don't want to rub dry but you know what I'm saying Ugh. Again, just pat all of that dry. All right, after I do that, I take my Mario Badescu Seaweed Toner. So they call it Seaweed Cleansing Lotion. This one is for combination skin, dry skin, and sensitive skin. I get my Mario Badescu from my Ulta store. They have a website online, which I will link below. Again, not sponsored, just really love the brand. They have different products for different skin types, combination, dry, sensitive, oily, wrinkles, pores, like literally any kind of skin type you have, they will have something to help that. So I take this on a cotton square. 
I only need one, but you can literally get a bag of these at dollar store, Walmart, anywhere. I take Cotton Square and not too much. Obviously, again, this is a brand new bottle because my other one I had completely used out. Put a good amount on it, like not too much. And then you're going to rub that all over your face. I try to rub in circular motions, trying to avoid the eye area. Make sure to bring it down to your neck, especially because if you wear foundation and you blend it down to your neck, you're going to want to. And it basically helps clean like dirt and grime like within the pores and it gets all of the excess off. And it smells really good. Once again, I love the seaweed scent. Some people don't. That's fine. I personally do love it. Again, when I'm having really bad skin days or something, I will use a face mask about two to three times a week, depending. Mario Badescu has enzyme revitalizing mask, also he has a flower and tonic mask, and he also has a botanical exfoliating scrub. Now, I'm not much of an ex exfoliator just because I do have sensitive skin, so this will probably be put aside in the box that I'm building up for a giveaway. By the way, guys, make sure you are subscribed because I'm literally building up a huge box, so stay tuned for all of that information. Other face masks I use are just simple ones that like I'll pick up from Sephora. So I have an aloe one for moisturizing. I have a red wine one for pores. I have a detoxifying one, a deep clearing one. So a bunch of different face masks just really depending on what I'm using it for. Sometimes I just like to use them to relax and in the bubble bath with a glass of wine. If I ever had wine, that's a different story. So because I don't need to do a face mask, I'm going to go ahead and go on with the next step, which is eye cream. I put my my eye cream on under my moisturizer because I feel like the moisturizer helps lock the eye cream in. I could be wrong. It could not do anything, but it's how I do it. So the little eye cream I use is the Hyal Hyaluronic eye cream, which is in this tiny little thing here. I need to get a bigger size, but I just haven't done that yet. And again, a little bit of this really does go a long way. You don't need a lot of it at all. Also, you don't need to use Mario Badescu. I keep forgetting to mention that this is just the brand that I use, but this is the order I go in and the order I do. I mean, I do suggest doing your skincare routine in the order that I go. If you have your own order, actually let me know. I'd love to hear about your guys' skincare routines, you know, in the comments below. Definitely interested. So I try to carefully pick it up on my fingers because I do have nails and I don't like getting product under my nails. So this right here is literally enough for one eye. So I tap it here and here and I rub massage that right in your under eye socket and i massage it up here too i don't know why i just do it's like a nice massage and then i'm going to go ahead and do the same thing with the other eye So after my eye cream, I use the moisturizer. So the Mario Badescu moisturizer I use is the Hydro Moisturizer with vitamin C. Make sure you moisturize your face. Even if you don't have a strict skincare regimen or you don't do much, at least wash and moisturize your face. A moisturizer does a world of difference. It helps for the flawless base. It keeps your skin hydrated and just feeling fresh and youthful, in my opinion. I could be talking out of my ass. Who knows? I think it works. Again, with this one, a little bit does go a long ways and it comes out really fast, so you have to be careful. Avoid your lips, because it doesn't taste good. <laughs> Bring it down to your neck. And then after all that is said and done, this is actually my mom's, but I use it as well until I get my own. This is just a facial spray with aloe, herbs, and rose water, hydrating, moisturizing, and it feels amazing. I think, personally, any kind of rose spray or hydrating facial spray is really good even like on hot days you can just spray yourself and you're just like oh so. mm, that feels so amazing and then last but not least i do like to use a lip balm my lip scrubs are usually for right before makeup application but this lip balm has been a lifesaver for me i do get dry trapped lips often i think it's just because of the moisture that we have out here like it really just kind of cracks everything so this is just a regular lip balm from mario Badescu. it smells amazing um you also have to be careful not to eat it because i'm a fat kid at heart 
Sorry if I keep looking up. My mirror is actually right behind. So that's pretty much it. That's how my skincare routine is. But I do have a couple other things to show you guys. If you go on to the Mario Badescu website, again, I'll have that link below. You can click on like they have a tab for samples and you take a quiz and based off of your results, they tell you what they suggest your skincare routine should be like. And then they will send you up to 10 samples for free. You just have to pay shipping. And I think the shipping was only $2.95. So mine actually came in and I'm really excited. They sent a little paper with it with your name on it and it gives you a layout of how your skincare routine should be, which I think is really awesome. So they sent me the Botanical Exfoliating Scrub, the Flower and Tonic Mask, an enzyme cleansing gel sample, the ceramide eye gel sample, oil-free moisturizer sample, chamomile cleansing lotion sample, don't mind the noise in the background, my mom has YouTube on, and then an herbal hydrating serum sample. So all of that came in this cute little box with the personalized note. I think that was really awesome, especially for only having to pay $2.95 and they send you all of those samples and they send you a good skincare regimen and they suggest to you how you should do your skincare routine and whatnot. The best advice I can give to anyone wanting to improve their overall skin health and skincare, again, make sure you're drinking lots of water, but even if you don't want to do a full regimen that exfoliates your face mask and stuff, at least get yourself a good face wash and a good moisturizer. And of course, never fall asleep with your makeup on. That is a big boo-boo. If I ever see anyone doing that, I'll s slap you for it, okay? Then again, you might like it. I don't know. I don't judge anyone kinks. We're all freaks, okay? But please, at least make sure you take your makeup off before bed and have a good face wash and a good moisturizer. You don't need to do everything else if you don't want. This is just how I personally use it. And again, this is just how I do my skincare routine. I personally love this brand. I really wish I would have taken care of my skin like this much sooner but you know, we all start somewhere. But honestly, the key to amazing makeup is literally good skincare, you know? That's pretty much all I gotta say about that. Now I'm gonna pop in a clip of all of my skincare stuff laid out on the table so y'all can see how I did this just cause I think, I don't know why I think I'm so funny. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop that clip in right now. So this is how I have my little setup here. Don't mind the <laughs> toner cloth I always already used. My awesome mirror. We're getting big growing up. I have kind of a better setup now. Anyway, so again, this is the face wash. This is the toner, the makeup remover, makeup remover, the eye cream, moisturizer, lip balm, the Equal Tools face brush. This is the Enzyme Revitalizing Mask. Some cotton squares. My bowl of water because, my dirty bowl of water now because I wash my face because I didn't want to film this in the bathroom. Bunch of different face masks. And then of course, the exciting things that I got from Mario Badescu. And then as always, water because you know you gotta stay hydrated. All right, everyone, so now that you've seen my skincare routine, see what I use, and you know, again, you don't have to use the same brand I use. You can use whatever brand that you find works best for you. I do believe that having a good, strong, solid routine is really the most important part of, you know, I really don't know what I'm trying to say, but you guys know what I'm trying to get at, and I think it really works for me personally, and I think if you guys wanted to try it out, definitely do it. And then again, two to three times a week, or even once or twice a week, a face mask, you know, just just relax in the bathtub with the face mask on, some music playing, kids fighting in the background, just drown it all out and just relax because I, to me, doing my skincare routine is therapeutic almost. It's just relaxing, my face feels good after, and it makes you feel like a whole new bitch. So I do hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thursday video is actually going to be an in-depth makeup tutorial. I know you guys have been wanting that for a really long time, so I will make that happen for you. Again, make sure to spread the word around that I'm going to be having a huge giveaway soon, like very, very soon within the next week. So keep your eyes out on that. Remember to stay strong, stay beautiful, and love yourself always. Bye, Glam Fam.